Whoa! Hello everybody and welcome to another game. This game is called Self Delusion. It's a demo game. And I really want to play it. It looks really cool. Huh. I those off in front of the fire. Oh. Free. It got dark very quickly and I had to set up camp here. I feel that the goal for my journey is close closer than ever. I hope I'm ready. It's raining, but there's no clouds. Interesting. What are you? Okay, nothing over here. Well, we can't really. We can actually go over here. That's cool. There's a rundown village near my camp. I wonder if anyone still lives there. Pumpkin? Read. If someone is rolling, what? Someone is rolling. You can hear steps. Then, then without looking back as fast as possible, run away. Only in the light of wax candles, you will not be eaten by the colorbuck with razor fangs. What is this? Is it a toy? I don't think that's a toy. Read. Once upon a time, in a cottage tucked into the edge of an ancient dark forest, there lived a very old, very poor couple, weak with hunger. The old man said to his wife, Look around the house and see if you can scrap together enough flour to make a color book. I don't know what a color book is. She coped carefully enough every container uh, and cabinet, but the old woman was only able to find a handful of flour and a few other ingredients. With care, she combined them, shaped it into a bread roll called a color book, which she baked uh, and laid on the windowsill to cool. However, their greedy neighbors smelled the delicious aroma. They gnashed their teeth in jealousy, saying, It's not fair that we go hungry while our neighbors have plenty. They stole the callback and threw it into the forest. What? Threw it into the forest? The old cow cried for a long time, for that was all they had. And there was nothing that could be done. Since that, since that day, no one has gone near that far. For why? F forest, 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 forest. People say that colorbug rolls uh, around in the dark, growing and gobbling up woodland animals and anything else in its path. This is why people should never invite that which another person has. I guess I won't be going back that way. How can you be so calm? What the fuck? A blaze man just came running at you. What the hell? Hello. Who are you? Pumpkin. Oh, oh, oh my ears. Oh, oh, oh. oh, volume, volume, volume. Oh, that was so loud. What is these triangles? Hmm. Oh, there's more. Are those toys 
Warspring, nothing. Or shipping, nothing. Better hope not. Uh, can. What the? Fuck. Let's go out of here right now. Yes? What's this hair? Whatever. Yeah, let me go out. Uh huh. Self delusion express survival course. The self delusion demo has a lot of unique mechanics that can be difficult to figure out. So we have provided seven simple tips to help you. Studying these tips will significantly increase your chance of survival you can you could also skip these tips and throw yourself in head first but we don't recommend it future swags here so now there's going to be some tutorial tips if you don't want to listen through them all you can just skip to a certain time that is stamped on the screen and i'll see you there Get this tutorial. Tip one: Stay alive until the morning. Wow, the main interface is located at the bottom left side of the screen. It has a timer half that the counts until the morning. Once morning arrives, the monster will vanish. Next. Tip two: Keep the oven happy. Find tired through throughout the house and throw them into the oven to keep it calm. If the oven's anger level rises, reaches 100%, then the house will fill with smoke and you won't be able to breathe. Pay attention to the indicator on the main interface and don't let this happen. Tip number three, monitor your stamina. Use shift button to run if needed, but keep an eye on the indicator at the bottom screen if your stamina drops to zero you will need time to catch your breath before you can run again tip four do not step on the laptop laptop lap leopard lap what if you hear scratch scratching noises watch out for the leopard on the floor if you see one don't step on it step in traps okay tip five stand in the light. If a color bug sees you, stand by the lit candle to, to scare it off. Candle's safety zone is in indicated by a circular of runes. Candles do not stay lit for forever though, and some creatures can even light them or snuff them out. Always try to have matches on hand. Tip 4. Don't let objects go mad. Quickly turn of objects that have gone mad, otherwise the less 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 she will enter the house and wonder if the less she does not come in, it will leave after s s after a certain amount of time, as long as it doesn't detect you. Seven. The ball is afraid of bills. If you hear a roar of an and it's a ball. You can chase cha chase it away by ringing the bell in front of the window that it's attempting to enter. Try to determine its location using the sound. It's easier to do this with headphones. Be quick because you cannot hide once it enters. Okay. It has long been known that evil spirits hate the morning lights most of all. If it happens that the monster comes to your house, then look for salvation with the crow, crow, crowing of Rasta. Why did these crazy toys drag me into this house? I don't know. I want to play with you apparently.
Oh, I should maybe... Maybe save them a little bit. Oh. Okay, so there's one he here. Doll. We have to find a window now. Don't we? Hello? Let's try this one more time. Oh, we know that. Okay. Let's go in here. Wait, the doll is gone. Wait, wait. Wait, they move around. Oh no. Um. It's not toys. Oh, I, 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 I don't want to play this anymore. I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. I don't think I, I can do anymore. Nah. I will try later though. On another episode. You can look forward to that. Mm -hmm. And remember, smash like, subscribe, ring the bell. If you ring the bell, you know when I'm going to play this game once more. Also comment saying if you thought this game was scary and share it with your friends that also likes horror games and go and play this game right now it's really good